Welcome to Linux Help Tutorial. In this video, we are going to see about how to install and configure Gaukamolo in Linux. Gaukamolo is a tool which allows to access our remote clients by using web browser. Gaukamolo is a clientless remote desktop tool. It will support some standard protocols like VNC, RDP, and SSH. Now let's see how to install Gaukamolo. First of all, you need to set the firewall rules as follows. Now run the following command to enable the firewall. Now type ufw space enable and hit enter. Now the firewall is enabled. Next run the command to allow the following ports in the firewall. ufw space allow space 22 and then 8080 now the port is allowed in the firewall. Now run the following command to install all required packages for Gaukamolo. Before that, make sure you have updated your repositories. To update, you can type apt get space update and then hit enter. Now the repositories are updated. Now install the required packages for Gaukamolo. Now type this command and hit enter. Now the package is installing, wait for some time, now the package is installed and now type this command and hit enter and wait for some time, now the package is installed. Next run the following command to download Gaukamolo from internet, now type this command and hit enter. Here you can see, now the package is downloaded, it is a tar file so we need to extract it, now type the command tar space hyphen xzf space and file name and then hit enter now the file is extracted here you can see a new directory is created now let's move to the directory now run the following command to configure and install the packages for Gaukamolo now type this command and hit enter and wait for some time now the Gaukamolo package is configured and installed now run the following command now this command is going to update library cache and init scripts. Now hit enter. Now run this command to create new directory for gaukamolo under slash etc. Now hit enter. Now run the following command to create new configuration file for gaukamolo under this directory. Now type this command and hit enter. Here create the following entry. Now create entry like this. Here we are mapping a new file. This file we are going to create in next step. Now save the file and now run the following command to create the file. Now type this command to create this new file user hyphen mapping.xml. Now hit enter. Here create the entry as follows. Now create entry like this. Here we are creating username and password for Gaukamolo. And this is the connections we are creating in Gaukamolo. This is the RDP connection remote desktop protocol for this client machine and then this is the second connection which is in SSH protocol. This is the IP for the client machine. This is the port number. Now create entry like this and then save the file. Now run the following command to create a directory. Now type this command and hit enter. Next run this command. Here we are creating a soft link for this file gaukamolo.properties to this path now hit enter now the soft link is created for this file and now download the following package now type this command and then hit enter now the file is downloaded here you can see next run the following command to move this file to the tomcat directory now type like this and then hit enter now the file is moved to this directory now all thing is set just to start the following services now run this command to start the service for tomcat and gaukamela daemon now hit enter now open your browser and point to the following link now type like this in your browser and then hit enter it will open the gaukamolo login page here you can see the login page here you can type your username and password to login now type your username and password and then click login 
here you can see we have logged into Gaukam Molo here you can see the connection we have created in configuration file now let's try to connect to the windows machine which is works in RDP protocol now let's try to open this connection RDP connection RDP is the protocol for remote desktop in windows machines now click here now it's connecting to my windows machine here I can log into my windows machine here you can see now I have logged into my windows machine here I can control my windows machine from my browser now click here to go back now let's try to connect to the second connection this connection is for Linux machine which will work in protocol SSH now click here now it's connected to my Linux client machine here type your login credential here you can type your username and then password to login here you can see now we have logged into the Linux machine to create connection you can type exit and then hit enter and click home to go to home page so this is how we can use Goku Molo to connect to our remote clients by using your browser hope this video is helpful for you thank you for watching